my backpack is something that i carry with me at all times during a school year so in this video i will be sharing what's in my backpack so starting with the backpack itself i have got this backpack from my high school back in india and i'm keeping it because this is a really good backpack all i need is two zips one for the books one for the tech stuff so starting for the tech stuff i have this laptop so this has been provided to me by georgia state university as you can see right here so this has been provided to me because i'm an honor student and i have 3.5 above gpa and i will put down the specification of this computer in the description below so moving on i also have this ssd always in my backpack because sometimes i need to share data with my friends so this is 256 ssd by samsung it's really really good so i always keep it in my backpack and i also keep a flash drive just for portability so moving on i always keep two headphones in my backpack one for the iphone because my iphone doesn't have a headphone jack and one for my computer so that i can edit my videos at all times so once i have a break during my two classes i can simply use these to edit my videos and also for reaction videos i have to keep this snowball blue eyes mic and a webcam so that i can make my reaction videos with carl at any time as well <laughs> also i always keep my tripod stand iphone 10r lav mic always in my backpack because sometimes maybe a class gets cancelled sometimes i get a free time so i can quickly come to this library room to record some videos so moving on with the school stuff i am carrying this classpad notebook from india and this is a thick notebook so i am able to fit all my five classes in this notebook so i have divided this notebook into five sections so that's convenient and i do not have to carry that much weight other than that i also carry this planner in my backpack so i write my to do list and also i carry this notebook at all times during meetings and stuff so that i can take notes out of those meetings Just like my backpack is 5 years old my pencil case is also 6 to 7 years old and I have all the things that I used to carry back at high school in this pencil case as well so I have pencil case eraser sharpener everything I need in my school in this case you might be wondering where are my textbooks so all my textbooks are as pdf in my computer because I buy the pdf version because it's easier for me to read and I have to carry less stuff in my backpack So moving on with the miscellaneous stuff I always carry a water bottle to keep myself hydrated a hanky because back in India I had my grandmother to remind me to put it in my pocket but now I have to keep it permanently in my backpack so that I do not forget it also a lunch box in which sometimes I pack peanut butter sandwich or sometimes brown rice and chicken and sometimes I forget to pack my lunch so I carry these protein bars so that I can eat them at least whenever I'm hungry also it can rain any time in Atlanta so I carry this umbrella in my backpack at all times and even in summer season I have to carry this jacket because sometimes in the library rooms it gets extremely cold so this helps me a lot in those times So last but not the least these sunglasses these are also for free I got these from the Twitter event so that I can protect my eyes from ultraviolet rays So you guys must have noticed that most of the things I have are either for free or really old including my laptop my phone iPhone 10R that you obviously know and this SSD which I won for outstanding research award and this is because of the fact that the money I earn my first priority has been to spend it on tuition and on bills so once I'm done with all those bills then only I get a chance to spend money on myself and also you guys must be wondering whether my laptop with 8 gigs ram i7 5th gen processor is good enough for programming or not the answer is yes it is decent for python or basic java programming but not really good enough for android development because sometimes you need to run emulators and it has less ram so it lags sometimes so if you're planning to get a new laptop then definitely go for 16 gigs ram and the latest processor so that wraps up everything so that's pretty much it for today thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next one goodbye